with that in mind, it'll be interesting to buy here in the spring. Let's see. Aforementioned bobolinks take to the efforts made on their behalf. I'm reasonably confident they will. Scent of sort beckons. These brush piles make habitats for rabbits to the New England cotton tail is being displaced by the more aggressive American one. <laughs> and so there's oh yeah, look at all the pine they pulled down. <laughs> That's great. Probably it was able to have it milled too. That would be cool. Dimension stock milled from trees used to clear an old meadow that bobblings may flourish once more. And the turn is indicated. Take it, we shall. Oh, I kind of remember how this was when it was all mature pines, reasonably mature ones. See some bird houses over there. Probably more bluebird work. There's wonderful coordination among these various land organizations towards generally agreed upon areas to work on bluebird restoration. Look at that. What those are. Warblers, probably. Bobolink encouragement. Beaver mitigation. <laughs> What do we do about the deer? What are these? I seem to like that tree. <laughs> but by the time I... Oh yeah, it's warblers. Maybe mad catchers. They're getting ready to head back to Trinidad or whatever. <laughs> we'll see them again in spring. With 
colorful new coats in their spring repertoire. Magnificent. <laughs> This way, <coughs> and the route to the summit will lie just beyond the screen of pine. There's a pretty substantial deer yard here. I've seen the tracks for it. So now we're back in some quasi-wetland. The confidence place. <laughs> 